Hi and welcome back to M's Den. We're Paul and Marie. And this is the Turning 10 Old Toys into £2,000 Challenge. Good afternoon. I hope everybody is well. It's week 50, hun. It is week 50. Oh, we've only got two to go, hun. I know. Da, 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 da. It's crazy, isn't it? Oh, crazy in a really good way. <laughs> <laughs> well, first we thought we'd um, give a couple of people a shout out, didn't yes. we? Yes. We, we um, um, yeah, Tam and Bell Resale. Yes. Now, We've learned a lot from their channel. We have we? learned a lot, and we, it's um, important to showcase people that have um, really helped in the challenge. And we have learned a lot. We've done quite a few um, sort of videos where we've mentioned them because we've um, because learned brands from their videos. So it is important to give them a shout do, out. They do. They do some great videos. I mean, the Tam's recently gone um, full time. Yes. And um, reselling. I mean, some of the things he picks up, I think, are fantastic. He got some LK Bennett He's... shoes, eighty pounds worth of <laughs> shoes for two ninety nine. <laughs> two ninety nine. Some of the prices up there in Scotland. We yeah. wish we were up there. Oh, I know. I know. I know. Some of the prices are absolutely crazy. I know. But um... Belle's promised me a picnic if we go up there. Oh, was she? So we have to go. We, we, yeah, we've got to go at some point. I love yeah, a picnic. Definitely. Love yeah. a picnic. So. Um... <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, it would be lovely. No. It's a shame they're so far away. I know. Otherwise, we'd be up there touching them all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> what are you like? Oh, I know. Um, yeah, they're they're so close to a thousand subscribers, and it would be really dangerously nice. close. Yeah, yeah. Well, you get them um, over there, don't we? Well, yes. Um, you know, if you haven't subscribed or or seen them, you know, you really should. You know, you're missing a trick. Go, go and have a look and. Um, yeah, subscribe to their channel because it, honestly, it's free. It's it's just a case of uh, they do some you know, great pushing content. the subscribe button. They do some fantastic content. Yeah, and um, yeah, like I say, we we have learned um, quite a lot from them. Haven't we? we have, um, yes. And um, Derek Tap Peddler was in one of their recent videos. Yes, he was. Yes, as well. So that was a bit of a surprise. It was yeah. a surprise. Bonus yeah. look. That's not <laughs> yeah. Bonus reseller. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Double doozy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yes, but, give them uh, a look because they're a lovely give them couple. A, yeah, we've put the um the link to their channel um down below. Yeah, so if you're um, a um part time reseller, um when you go full time it all it really means is a lot less a lot less sleeping, more sleepless nights. <laughs> more sleepless nights, a lot, so more, a lot more worrying. More work and, yeah, but you're your own boss. Yeah, you do you what do you want. You do what you want when you want, and you're the one that, um, you know, um, you, you're accountable to yourself sort yes. of thing. So if, if you don't work hard enough, you don't get paid. It's simple no. as that. So you, you, do you know what I mean? You, you, you have to work hard. But it's not um, easy, is it? Because you, you can do what you want, but you haven't got the money to do what you want. It's that, <laughs> it's that sort of lifestyle reselling, isn't it? It is, yeah. But like I said, it's... it's I, I don't, we wouldn't do anything different. We love would it. We, we, we love absolutely it. love it. Yes, we do work a lot of hours, but um, but but we love doing it. You know, it's it's that fact that you're your own boss. You haven't got someone telling you what to yeah. do. Yeah. And like I say, there's there's definitely a tam a, a, a tam. There's definitely <laughs> a, a talent there with with tam and talented Bell. tam. That's talented what I'm calling tam. From now. That's talented it. Tam. Yeah. Um, yeah. But um, but yeah, some of the stuff that they pick up. Um, you know, both of them it is is fantastic. Yeah, we so. get very envious, don't we? In we some of their we bargains. do. We Prices do. are so much cheaper up there than, um, yeah. than where you used to we're, down we're, here. We're, we're, what? what? That's the TV much? so many times. <laughs> But, but it's also uh, worth mentioning the lovely Belle. Yes. Um, because um, she's always looking glamorous. She, she oh, she is. Shame. Yeah. <laughs> when I walk up at her boots, though, it's pretty much jeans and a T-shirt or that red jumper. And your um, tutu with hat. some boots. Yeah, my tutu <laughs> hat. And um, when Belle goes out, she's all looking gorgeous, <laughs> matching accessories and... Just looks lovely, stylish. That's how I'd say she looks stylish. <laughs> Not scruffy. I'm more scruffy than yeah. stylish. But there you go. So uh, definitely, um, definitely go and, and subscribe to them. Yeah, yes. definitely. I mean, uh, Belle does have a craft channel as well. We'll hoof that up as well. We'll look. hoof that up, and um, yes, we'll put a link down to that as well. And she's talented. Again, she's very, very talented. Yes. Um, but uh, but yeah. Well, so, we better move I on think from we'll this move, yes. love fest <laughs> of Tam and Belle resale. Um, but also want to shout out the lovely, their lovely children, Cole and Dexter. Oh, yes, yes. 
So we're going to move on because we do have uh, uh, some work to do here, huh? We have to get on with week 50. Week 50. Week 50 of the 21st it's birthday challenge. Nearly a year. It's crazy. I know. And if you're new to these videos, um, it, you know, we've taken a little bit of time to start this one because we... <laughs> We want to shout out the lovely Tavern Bell. Yeah. <laughs> but basically the premise of the video is a year, almost a year ago, 50 weeks ago, we started this challenge where we, as resellers, want to do something else for our daughter, who's going to be 21 in two weeks' time. Mm. We started this year-long challenge thinking it was a really good idea at the time, yeah. not realising quite how much work um, was yeah. involved. Yeah. Um, and the plan was to take 10 of our daughter's old toys that she no longer wanted and sell them and the profit we get so we take off the fees take off the postage just left with the profit and that goes and gets reinvested to buy clothes and shoes a topic we knew nothing about that's it it's and a big challenge for us we've been it? learning haven't we for 50 yeah. weeks now about different brands it does go to show that we have been learning but we again haven't scratched the surface no there's and so there, much there's so much to, to learn, learn. and the, the, you do need a massive chunk of time to learn, you know what I mean, yes. or, or everything about clothing. I don't think you'll ever learn everything about clothing. No, but, but we are there's... pleased with sort of what we've learned. We've just, spoiler alert for a future video, we went to a boot sale at the weekend and bought a vintage 1990s Laura Ashley dress for £1.50, mm. a velvet style dress. Yes. So we have learned something along yes. the way, huh? Yes, yes. So, so you um, picked that up and you knew straight away, I knew didn't straight you? straight away, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. we did a week, didn't we, on um, vintage Laura Ashley. Laura yeah. Ashley. And I, mm. I remembered, I finally remembered something. <laughs> um, so we picked that up. So yes, we are learning, but it, mm. you know, it's we're older, so it does take we, a bit we of are, time. We are older, unfortunately. It's remembering it, isn't it? It's it, the is, problem. it is, yeah. We do struggle <laughs> the older we get. Yeah. We? The more of a struggle it is, but yeah, we're, we're getting there. But anyway, back to the video. To it, yeah. So with the money we got off. from Emily's Toys, we have so far bought 229 items of clothing or shoes. We have sold 154 items. We currently have 75 items listed. And the current kitty is £967.37. What's the listing value then, my love? The listing value of the 75 items, is it oh. now? Yeah, it's £2,313.08. And have Sorry. we got any breaking news, Han? I've you know, so. We have, we have. It's taken a little while, but we have got some things to show you here. So we're going to start off. I think some of these trail on the end of the sale. Yeah. So the profit is a little bit less than we would have liked, but they have gone and we've got some profit to go into the kitty. So let's start with this weird fish tunic dress. We paid £3 for that. It's sold for £9.68. We've taken off the fees and the postage and we have £5.79 going back into the kitty. We have this Wallace maxi dress. This was lovely. It cost mm. £2. Sold it for £12, so £7.81 goes back into the kitty. This was a vintage Tesco's blouse. This was, I thought it might have been part of um, a uniform. A uniform. Well, yeah, I don't know if it right. was. I don't know if it was. Well, it but, look, because it, it looked like the sort of Tesco's the material. Themed, and the, and the, and the, yeah, yeah. You know, but, it just seemed it, didn't it? But, yeah. But we paid £3 for this. It sold for £15.19, and p so £10.59 goes back into the kitty. We've got these M&S crop trousers, hun. They sold for sixteen ninety nine. Originally cost four, so twelve pounds sixteen goes back in. Then we've got this Bomb Marsh reversible skirt, hun. Pay six pound for this. Sort of thought it would go for more money, mm. but we took an offer in the end, and we're just we did, yeah. relieved to get rid of it. Yeah. It went for fifteen pounds, so ten pound forty two goes back into the kitty. We have a crew clothing men's shirt that sold for ten pound. We originally paid three. £6.06p and six P goes back into that kitty. Mm. We have a TU lady. Is it TU? 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 I don't know. <laughs> TU. We've murdered the company. I don't know. I don't know. Or TU? 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 Anyway, we've talked way too long about that, <laughs> logo, that brand. So um, we we sold it for £12.99. Um, we paid £3. So £8.67 goes back into the kitty. Now we've got a... Shout out here for the um, the legend that is Carboot Chris. We almost talk about him in every single video. Oh, we do. Don't I we? think yeah, we're coming yeah. across a little bit obsessed. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, but we know him, don't we? He's one of our friends, hun. One of our friends. <laughs> he sent us, what a lovely man, sent us, um, took pity on us and yeah. donated, I think, a handful of 
cycling jerseys. Quite a while ago. One wasn't sold it? like it was last year. Yeah. <laughs> it's, I only got them on a couple of weeks ago. One sold last week, I think, in last week's video, and another one has sold. So thanks, Chris. Yes, it's thank the you very Bio much. Racer cycling top. We managed to get eleven ninety nine for that. Mm. Seven ninety three is going back into the kitty. So you can go through the profit, my love. The profit um, from this week is sixty nine pounds and forty three pence. Wow. Woo. Sorry, my love. I was a bit late in my woo because I was enjoying my sip of coffee there. So that's not too bad, is it? So, so far, we have bought 229 items. We have sold 162 items. We currently have 64 items. What's the new kitty, my love? The new kitty. 1,000. <laughs> And thirty-six pounds and eighty pence. So we've gone over the thousand. <laughs> we've gone pounds. over the thousand. Oh, it's only taken fifty weeks. The, I was going to say <laughs> this should have been about twenty weeks ago. We should have. Yes. Across I thought that. we were going to finish the challenge early at one point. Oh, did no, you? No, no, I was a little bit oh, out well. there, Mum. Never mind. So what's the listing value currently? <laughs> then? No, listing value is obviously going down because we're selling items. Uh, it's two thousand one hundred and fifty-three pounds and sixteen pence. I was running out of breath there. And how much have we got left to go in two weeks? How? <laughs> What's up in two weeks <laughs> we have got to get 963 pounds and 20 pence is that all hun yes achievable piece of cake mm. so there you go that's where we are with the challenge for this week i don't know if we said that at the beginning of the video because i always forget to say but the whole point of it was to give emily oh, yeah. a two-week <laughs> holiday that's what we're trying to do it's like a car crash oh, isn't it? is, a is, is, yeah um a two-week holiday she's never had two weeks off i know that sounds a bit odd but she's never has she yeah she's had we, holidays but never had two we've weeks. only had one oh, and that was oh. our honeymoon yeah our honeymoon was <laughs> the last two weeks the joys of being a reseller you, know. you don't get to have a long time off do you you don't so a lovely lady called Miss A took pity on us really early on in the challenge and yeah. sent us a box of 30 branded items to help us out. And it's a blooming good job she did, hun. I know. Because, um, you know, she's been such a legend. We've sold those 30 items and we've done it sort of in the same way. But Miss A's contribution is towards Emily's spending money. Yeah, so two challenges running separately. Competing against competing myself. Competing against each other. That's it, yeah. So with Miss A's fund, we've bought 241 items. We've sold 145 items. We currently have 176 items. And the... I've done them the wrong way round, hun. Where are we, the current kitty? <laughs> I don't know She's, why. Every time, there's a challenge somewhere along the line, isn't there? <laughs> I like to keep this, going to times. <laughs> <laughs> the current kitty is £763.50. And the listing value of those 176 items listed on eBay is £3,270. And sixty-two pence. So we've still got a fair amount of stock. There's a lot of stock to sell in on there. two weeks. <laughs> I know, I know, but there's a this surprising the amount. And even when you look at the amount of items Miss A's got on there, one hundred and seventy-six. Yeah, it's quite a lot, isn't it? Quite to high. The other challenge is seventy-five. Yeah. So it's but, crazy, yeah, isn't it? It is crazy. So is there any breaking news for Miss A's? Yes. There yes, is. there is. We've sold <laughs> not, not as many, but we sold four. I don't quite know why we're not selling as many because there's more items on. It doesn't make any sense at all. It but doesn't make any sense, no. Let's have a look. We've got this Wallace, um, I'm going to say Bole Bolero, Bolero? Bolero. I want to say Bolero, you know, Bolero, after, yeah, Bolero, after um, Bolero. those skating people. Tor well, Torval and Dave, the skating people. But I couldn't think of their names, hun. <laughs> um, so it's a Wallace, and we veered off Bolero. Yeah. We paid £3 for it. We sold it for £10. It's £6 and 6p has gone back into the into the kitty. We have a debut ladies Bolero. It's crazy, isn't it? Two in close yeah. succession yeah um we paid three pound for that um six nine sixteen ninety nine it sold for so twelve pounds sixteen has gone back in the kitty we have a i think that's rima men's shirt um mm. that we paid three pound for we sold it for 9.99 so six pound and six p's going back in the kitty and then we're finishing with a wallace ladies blouse that we paid two pound for and we sold it for 12.99 so eight pounds 67 has gone back into the kitty Oh, I really need a swig of my coffee now, huh? I'll no, let no, you do that. Um, I'll let you let you get to your mouth this time. Oh, because, lovely. Uh, <laughs> yes, though so the profit from that is thirty-two pounds and ninety-five pence. So it's still building, isn't it? Oh, no woo today. Oh, woo! Sorry. <laughs> That's so, what I was waiting for. <laughs> so with Miss A's fund, we've bought two hundred forty-one items. We've sold one hundred forty-nine items. We currently have one hundred seventy-two items. The current kitty now is seven hundred and ninety-six pounds and forty-five pence, Ooh. and the um, listing value is um, 
3,192.66 pence. That's not too bad then, honey. It's building, isn't it? it is We've got building. to. I'm sort of sensing we're not going to get to our target, but I don't know. Perhaps that's just me. Perhaps that's just me. I don't think we're going to quite make it. But we've still got two weeks to go. We could um, have well, phenomenal was, sales. We, we could. We <laughs> I could doubt have, it. No, but you never know, do you? That's the thing. You never know, because I'm guessing that, um, no, still not time to have a sale yet, is it? We're too far away from the end of the month. Ish. Yeah, not not far no. away, but we will probably have another sale, won't we? Just and, at the end, um, I think, just, just to try and last sort of push. Yeah, get as much um, in as possible. Yeah, but uh, but yeah, I, I highly doubt we're going to make it. We're going to make it, um, but, but you know, but when you look at the two challenges together, almost up at eighteen hundred pound mm. in total. Yeah, which is not bad. I mean, she's going to have an amazing time with that. Mm. Yeah, See. we are over eight and eighteen hundred. Yeah. yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Mm. So anyway, now yes. we're going to move on to the very exciting um, part of the video. If you're if you're um, new to these videos, we each week for fifty weeks we've been looking at two clothing brands that we knew nothing about and having a little look at them. Look look at the prices because what we want to do is go into a charity shop or go into a boot sale and know roughly mm. what we want to spend. So yes. our sort of theme is if we spend a fiver, we want to list it for twenty and up. So that's the plan, isn't it? Yes. So I've started with this brand, hun. I don't know if I'm going to say it right, but it looks like ne Nestle, Nestle. You know, like the chocolate, and I think that might be the reason I've chosen it because I fancy, the other day I fancy a bit of Milky yeah. Bar. <laughs> so this is, ne I'm going to say Nestle, Nestle, but you no, can't get Nestle. much online. Nestle, it's a French clothing brand mixing vintage and contemporary influences to offer a variety of sil silhouettes for plus sizes. Finally, mm. Hans, someone that does plus <laughs> sizes. So um, I always have a look. This week I have widened the net a bit and I've chosen a between the 1st and the 15th to look at pre-owned prices just to have a widespread because not, not all brands sell you know 30 a day. Some brands yeah. only sell the odd one every now and then. But they shouldn't be overlooked, so um, I thought we'd have a look at this one. So between the 1st and the 15th, pre-owned prices, 24 sales. So not massive sales, um, but 11 of those have gone for over £20. And the prices of those were between £23 and £70. So let's show you some of the um, things we've seen. We've got this bold print caftan dress. Now I've written down great photo. All right. So I'm guessing this is a fellow reseller who's... Um, yeah. Who's who's taken a picture of this? They've also managed to get thirty three pound. So it's sixteen bids they've got to this, and five pound thirty nine postage. Then we've got a hanky Largan look hem coat. Now I will have to Google what Largan look is because a lot of them with this brand have got Largan look um, okay. as a keyword. So it must mean something. I will have to do some yeah, research. Yeah, have to look into that. Yeah. So they managed to get twenty five pound plus three pound forty nine for this. Then we've got a vintage boiled wool coat. Never heard of boiled mm. wool, but there you go. £70 they got for this. <laughs> then we've got a fleece lined coat. Now I've put on here um, similar style, didn't achieve full potential. Now this is because this fleece lined coat, which is very similar to the previous photo, had 10 bids but only achieved £21 and £3.50. And if you've watched any of these videos, it is mainly me moaning about how if you put something on auction it can go so low sometimes it can go it can go either way but yeah you're risking it i think yes um, and as for someone who's looking at brands sometimes you can have a quick glance at solds and look at the the values and go oh yeah, that's, not, that's worth not worth bothering much, but it's, it's, but no, it's because to... 90 percent of those people are selling them on yeah, bids, so to they're not achieving that. their full potential yeah you have to ignore those, really. Um, That's yeah. it. So I have started um, fellow resellers, um, Bethany and Austin. We <laughs> we love them. They <laughs> they uh, did a video about how they go to the highest price first. And I have started doing that. When I've started yeah. doing the research, I've started looking at the highest prices first yeah. to sort of see what you can get, not base it just on the people that yeah. put stuff on auction. So there you go. I've harped on about that again. <laughs> so then we're going to go on to this mesh Asymmetrical hem jumper. This went for twenty two ninety nine plus three pounds sixty. So there you go. That covers Nestle or Nestle. I don't quite know. It's probably pronounced totally different. I couldn't to what even it is. find. Yeah, it probably is. I couldn't <laughs> even find out when the company started. Oh right. Online, okay. you put that in, and it thinks you're trying to say Nestle chocolate. Oh. Um, so yeah, okay. hell of a job just trying to get that detail. So yeah. now we're going to move on to another brand that we knew nothing about, never heard of, called Marnie. Now, I chose this hum because when I was a kid, I used to love that Hitchcock film, Marnie. It used to scare the bejesus out of me. 
Um, I don't actually remember. It was that. the one where the woman, she every time she saw red, she got really scared. So anyway, no, I don't off. it was that a really one, good film, think. but I watched mm. it quite young and it was quite scary. Yeah. So anyway, back to work. Marnie is an Italian luxury fashion brand which was founded in 1994 by, I'm going to pause here, hum, Consuelo <laughs> Castiglione. <laughs> I've been practicing that, huh? <laughs> and, it's a, <laughs> and it's acclaimed worldwide for its women's, men's and kids ready to wear and accessories. So I've done the same thing. I've looked at the same period of time, the 1st to the 15th, just to be fair. All pre-owned prices, 97 sales. So more demand yeah. or more supply. It depends which way you look at mm, it. Mm. So 80 items have sold for over £20. And the prices are over, have gone between 22 and 190. So a little bit stronger prices on this brand. Yeah. So we're going to start with this brown flare skirt. 49.99, huh? That's oh, wow. 4.49 for a brown flare That's skirt. <laughs> so we'll be looking out for Marnie. Yeah. Then we've got a women's um, orange. Uh, I've got a Hell's orange shoes. 62 pounds 60 for these shoes. There you go, 100% silk skirt, hum. £88.50 this sold for. Then we have a red ribbed drawstring top, £49.99 plus £3.35. Now the, the last one is quite interesting because this is a gathered floral midi full skirt. This sold for £190. Wow. And the reason I've highlighted this one is mainly because it was one of the highest yeah. ones that sold. But also because on the exact same day, someone was selling one on auction right. and um, they managed to achieve 24 bids, yeah. but they went up to £105 and 445 right. for exactly the same item. Yeah. So it does sort of highlight if you're, if you're not desperate for the money and you can just list it in, uh, on a buy it now and wait a bit. Yes, you that, that's it. You can get items. more money. Yes, okay. Yes, you do have to wait a little bit longer, but um, but yeah, generally you do achieve more, don't you? That's yes, I mean thing. it but is. Like I say, some people just want rid and quickly, and they like do. I say, and, their option um, is a quick way of doing that. But you, yeah, unless something is extremely rare, um, I don't think auction would um, would be. It the way wouldn't to go. be for us because no. then the amount of. Um, you know the amount of items that I see that only go for one fifty or two pound. Yeah. You know, good high branded items that are, mm. are worth a lot more. Yeah. Um, but yes, so um, hopefully you can have a look out for Nestle, Nestle. I'm not quite sure how to say it. And Marnie. <laughs> hopefully Marnie is just Marnie. Well, hopefully Marnie's right, but Italian. you don't know it's, it's Italian. Probably, That's it. Probably it's, needs it's to be embellished a bit. There. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yes, two brands that we would. Will now also be looking out for and trying to remember. So hopefully, yeah. you can have a look and um, you know find mm. them too. Yeah. So that concludes week fifty, hun. We're dangerously week 50. close now, aren't I we? I know it's so close. If you like, I say if you haven't seen these videos before, there is previous ones that you can go and look on the playlist. And sometimes they're put um, together better than this one. Oh, so. <laughs> much better than this one. <laughs> <laughs> this haphazard yes. <laughs> video. <laughs> But no, that's sort of where we're at. We want to um, just thank everyone for their support. Lots of people leave us comments, which is really kind of you. Yes. We, like, we look forward to reading the comments, don't we? Oh, we do, yes. Um, yeah, definitely. So yeah, we, just, we, we might we might always get to them oh, quickly. It takes two days to get to them. <laughs> we do get to but them. But we do have two stores and we make three <coughs> videos a week. So we're, we're kept quite busy, aren't we, hun? Yeah, um, yeah. But we do answer all our comments. It just sometimes takes us a little bit of time. <laughs> <laughs> but um, there you go, hun. Week 50. We're dangerously close to finishing now. We are. We are. It's um, scary. It is scary, yeah. Really? I mean, how quick has those 50 weeks gone by? A year has pretty yeah. much just gone just like that. It has it's, gone quickly. It's... Not when you're actually doing the, making no, the videos. No, that but... goes quite slowly. But when you're actually, you know, when you look back and you yeah. think, blimey, that's, that's um, gone so quick. Mm. Yeah. But there you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> so... As always, thanks for watching. Yes, thank you very much. And, you know, do give us a thumbs up. Yeah, and, two, uh, two thumbs well, up. No, that's no, not, no, don't, don't, do two, don't, don't, don't click do it two. twice. <laughs> Just the You'll one. You'll take it away. <laughs> Just one. Just one. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, press the subscribe button. It is free, you know, if you do like our content. So, um, yeah, thank you very much. Thanks.